everybody, it's a Week in Review. Today we have special visitors at Trinity Elementary and they sang a song with us. And then we had so much fun. Here at Lipscomb Elementary in fifth grade at STEM Lab, we were given the necessary parts to build an M-Bot with a partner. Some assembly required. Um, we could code it to control its uh, movements and its sound. Jacket time is 20 minutes at the beginning of our day. Um, and it's just like a little group where we meet with um, some of the people that are in our grade and a designated teacher. We talk about um, random things every day. We kind of just come together and have a time where we get to talk about whatever's on our mind. We did a classroom town show about um, everybody's acts in town. We're in Foundation of Technology and right now we are doing CO2 cars and we're flying them down the track at about 70 miles an hour. Walnut Grove Elementary is so fortunate to have Tennessee Golf House pros come out and share their gift of golf with our students. I was in the 5th and 4th grade spelling meet and I am the winner and I also am going to be attending the county spelling meet. This week at Longview, we are skating. Skating! <laughs> Today, the fifth graders and are separating into their businesses for BizTown to prepare for work for BizTown. Today, we were getting pumped up for the Titans game on Sunday. And today, we we recognized students and we gave our teacher and employee of the year month of the year award. Do you know about the 1920s? Today in Miss Roberts' class at Jordan Elementary, we learned about the 1920s and what people did in the 1920s, such as their entertainment, the music they liked, and their clothing. Today at Mill Creek, we are doing the spelling bee. Today was the written portion, and then if we make it past this round, we get to go on to the school-wide spelling bee. This week at Ravenwood, we learned about Kung Fu. Today at Thompson Station Middle School, we teamed up with Spring Station to fight back against cancer. This week at Renaissance, we had our first Coffee Ass of the New Year, where students, freshmen through seniors, performed covers and originals of songs. And today in Guidance, we're learning about small problems and big problems. Hi, I'm at Nolensville High School, and this week in theater production, we are using recycled materials to make our show Into the Woods. This week at Hunter's Bend, we're celebrating our Titans. Good luck, Titans, on Sunday. Today at Grassville Middle School we are playing board games that we made about feudalism and the ancient Roman Empire. In first grade we're talking about animals in their colonies and um, where they live. We're with the third grade chorus and we've been practicing the song A Million Dreams. And we're going to perform it on the very first day at our new Creekside building. Today we are lighting different types of metals on fire to see the color and we can determine the wavelength from the color. We built a Lego rover and we programmed it on the iPad to make it move around. We learn technology, engineering, science, and math by building this rover in the computer lab. Today in American History 8th grade social studies, we took some time out to learn a country line dance that uh, involves uh, 1959's Jimmy Horton's The Battle of New Orleans uh, as we're studying the Battle of New Orleans and the War of 1812 and its significance in American history. Westwood had a spelling bee and my winning word was confection. This week at Woodland we are practicing for the Mid-State Orchestra concert. Right now we're in PE. This is our third period class and we're just, it's a free day and the benefits of PE are it's improved health and exercise for us. We are learning the relative size of the planets with Plato. We were participating in the spelling day. The word is furrow. The word's part of speech is a verb. This week, Independence High School hosted a career fair for current and prospective students so that they could learn about the opportunities available here at Indy. All the HMS 8th graders went to Independence High School to learn about the CTE classes that will be available for us next year. In our third grade science class, we're learning about planets. We wrote down rectilinear shapes 
and how we did that is we made it, our classroom a little like operating room. Today is the goal gathering because we are 50% done with the school year and it is 50s theme and we have Coke floats. Today we used wagon bots to travel the Oregon Trail. Uh, we're learning about art in Spanish right now, so we're doing an art project with trash to kind of, you know, tell people to make sure they pick up their trash and stuff because it's hurting the environment. We learned how to model with Play-Doh the inner and outer planets in our solar system. The biggest thing we learned was that a lot of planets are a lot smaller than others. Here at our name, we are committed to recycling. Today in fifth grade math, we are measuring objects around the room. And we're trying to find the area of each object we, me we measure. Today in science, we are measuring the greenhouse gases over the past hundred years into the present and towards the future and how they affect climate change. Animal knowledge came to help us kick off our second nine weeks. It was a great kickoff for how hard we are working on reading and math. This week, Hydrogena came and talked to us about sound waves and light waves. We looked at lasers with refraction glasses. It was a great week. Thanks for watching.